guys, welcome back to our channel. We hope you're doing great. And today we are going to Krishna Farm. Yes, yeah, so we are going to Krishna's farm. If you guys don't know what Krishna Farm is, so basically the people who believe in uh, Krishna, they are known as devotees. They live there and they grow their own food. They their source of dairy product is the cows, which they always like keep with them themselves and yeah make curd milk yeah out of mm -hmm. them so they don't buy basically the things they eat and all those stuff and yeah also devotee means follower that's what i said at the first yeah okay and, and the reason that we're not uploading that much is because they're uh, like editing two videos right now so uh, um, um, if you see this first then there's another one coming or if you see this one after you can look back into our channel uh, uploads and then you can see if we have a other one or not and like the people who don't know who Krishna is basically he is uh, our Hindu god there's only uh, he's like the one and people think there are a lot of gods more than a million yeah but it's like he's like the one main person and he have came in uh, indians uh, history uh, in like different forms and like different i don't know yeah places no not places uh, different times or like different period of indian history and that's the reason like he has his different forms and so one we can name as rama and yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Alright guys, so now we have arrived to the Krishna's farm. This is the view of the outside. So there's like three uh, rooms, I mean three houses connected together. This is like the main entrance how you go and these three are connected with each other and there's like the small garden as you can see these flowers are so pretty i really like them so there's like the mini garden where they have all the flowers and yeah now let's go inside so as we enter first you can see there's this big mini kitchen here people wash their hands after they eat and if you want to eat something you just grab a bowl from here and the cups and this is the wash this is the bathroom so you bath and this of course <laughs> whatever the bathroom does and this is like the shoe stand for the slippers and all the shoes you keep and then the side there is this frame and now let's go inside so uh, as we enter first, you can see this the picture of the all the big gurus, Prabhupada, and this is like his statue and all. And this side, there's the schedule list, what does a person does, like who's gonna cook, who's gonna clean, and all those. Those are the schedule list out there. And here is the small window over here. And then this there's this drawer where we have all the books and the instruments to play like kartalas. And this is my father showing again a picture of Prabhupada. And this is the chanting mantra, Hare Krishna's. And then here is another big frame of Lord Krishna lifting up Govardhan, mountain Govardhan with his pinky finger. And here is the like the main place where they do all the pujas and all the stuff there is the statue of lord krishna and radharani that's what i'm showing again from the closer and this side there are books and this is like the place where they serve us food we take the food from here and these are the small cute little flowers which i want to show you guys again and that's the view of the outside and yes this and this is the again a big statue of lord krishna as you can see and then here we have again two more photo frames of lord krishna uh, both of them includes the gopis 
and here's the board which i don't know what it is and about so and here yeah. is like the quick view of the room which is up you can just see him like crawling <laughs> but this guy is happily in his world because he's shot of course he's shot look at him nine year old shot as hell <laughs> Alright, so now we're on top and I'm gonna give you a quick view of this room too. So let's get started. Hey guys, so this is like the place from where you enter. You climb up the ladder and then you enter the room basically. And that's the view of the outside from this mini little window which is so cute. And this is the drawer, that's the chair. And here we have this thingy where you put all your clothes and stuff in that's the bed and here is again a picture of lord krishna and here's also again a picture and those are she sells and that's the mini heater and this is the second bed where ganesh is lying on and that's again a new picture over there and ganesh is trying to explain something but i just ignored him as usual and this is the big bean bag i guess yeah that's what you call it and that's again how from where you go down and there again i'm gonna show you the view of the window there are my parents out there <laughs> Minding his own business, and here you are, yeah. just being scared yeah, of nothing. Yeah. 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 There is going to be water. You can just cut normally okay. and just, I don't know, start saying mm -hmm. about the. Okay, so we cook. We cook here twice a day, and um, we use uh, clean products. We have also donations from the shop. I mean, they just like give us um, vegetables and fruits. We use it, mm -hmm. and um, before we eat, we never try food when we cook it, and then we offer it to Krishna. We have a beautiful altar. Um, so yeah, and um, hopefully we try to satisfy the Lord first, and then serve it to devotees. <laughs> <laughs> Thank yeah. you. And so this is like the place where they cook and all those stuff. 
thing and i think this is like where you're going to serve this yeah, to the this krishna is the god's plate okay that's the god plate and this is the yummy cake and these are like all the dishes everything here there's like the kitchen where like all the uh, food has will all is prepared and all so yeah have you seen have you seen the cake yeah <laughs> <laughs> yes yes yeah. yep Okay. Welcome to the Krishna farm, which is located outside of Fuebo, here in Skåne. We acquired this farm a little more than four years ago. We moved here with uh, four horses and three cows and two oxen. The idea is to show an example of a small-scale organic farm according to permaculture principles that's supposed to grow food for a small community of about 10 persons. And we very much welcome volunteers of all ages, specifically the younger generation, to come out here, have a look and have a nice time. We also have a beautiful temple room in which we can perform kirtan and uh, classic bhakti yoga, etc., studying of scriptures. So uh, this is Krishna Farm. It's easy to come from Malm and Lund. And, uh, you know, please feel free to come. Welcome. Thank you. Alright guys, so thank you guys so much for watching our video. Hope you guys have enjoyed and make sure to like, subscribe and comment, comment down below and see you guys in the next vlog. Bye bye. bye.